Uh, this particular oil is mentioned in my book, Heal With Oil, and I talk about its uses and how you can use it today as part of your healing. Um, but I wanted to show it to you before we talk about the traditional uses because it is such a thick oil. In fact, it's more of a resin and it comes out almost like a gum. But this was used on Yeshua's body after they took him down from the cross and wrapped him in linens. And this would have been mixed with the myrrh, which is also a gum resin. So it would have encased him almost like a mummy. But when you think about where this comes from, this is grown in Vietnam. Uh, and then some of the other spices I've talked about, like spikenard being from China or, you know, Italy, uh, some of the other places that these fragrances come from, you see that it's all a picture of the nations and how God's bringing them all back together to tell his story. Isn't that neat? And so ironwood essential oil has been used as incense in religious ceremonies since ancient times. And it was known as the wood of the gods. It is still prescribed in Chinese medicine as a remedy for colds and digestive orders. It's also used in traditional Ayurvedic medicine. Argawood is considered to be very warming, stimulating, and is traditionally used for gastrointestinal issues, skin diseases, and bronchial asthma. So it's also an aphrodisiac. So that's why it's probably so popular as a perfume. Now burning the agarwood incense was commonly thought to clear the mind, help prevent any kind of infections. Now the medicinal uses of agarwood has the ability to uplift the, uplift the emotions. It's used for depression, stress, and anxiety. And when you smell this, it's almost like a very deep wood uh, smell, almost like the earth. It can really be very centering and it's used for meditation. It's also good for urinary tract infections as well as menstrual disorders. So it's an amazing thing. It has also antimicrobial properties which can help fight bronchitis and any kind of skin conditions like acne. It supports the nervous system as well as the circulation.